Lalande has finally decided that it is summer, just in time for my birthday in a couple of days' time. I'm running down because Annalise is coming to do my hair. We're freaking out because the post has arrived, but the van is white. The van's supposed to be yellow. Why is the that? The van's supposed to be yellow. That's this is not yellow. right. Are we sure it's the postman? Maybe it's someone... Um, Masquerade. It definitely posing. looks like a regular postman. No, no, it's definitely the postman. Maybe he's getting fancy. Have they changed the colour of the fat? I hope not. I'm going to go and ask. No. And why is they changing them to white ones? I just asked. Natty thinks it's hilarious that we care, but <laughs> Vivian and I are in a state of some shock That's right now. Funny. How are we supposed to know who's the real postman and who's just a white van guy? It could be Bread Lady here, for instance. But it was so pretty before. Lovely little yellow postman, the heart leapt, going, oh, the yellow van has arrived. It was so cheery. <laughs> We'll look back on this in 50 years ago. Do you remember when they were yellow? That's our problems right now. It's a permanent change, he said. Yes, yeah, no, I heard. I stood behind you. I was like, no. <laughs> I'm, I'm saying no changing. It's like before our very eyes. Why? What? Because <laughs> <laughs> they were yellow. Yeah, practical. <laughs> I'm sure you mentioned that. I was shocked, actually. Yeah. I saw it. And I was like, no, that's not La Poste. And I saw the uniform and then the sticker. I was like, yeah. oh, it, it is. Yeah, a bit disappointing as an experience yeah, receiving like post what? from that. Oh, at least it's the same lovely postman. We've got that. I mean, he didn't seem devastated not to be driving around in a bright yellow. He did actually, he did actually oh, did say he? that he thought that it was better before because people always recognise them when they arrived. Yeah. yeah. And as he said, it, this is more banal, he said. Looks as if there's been a run on Annalise's services today. Yeah. You need to set up a proper little salon here, I think. I mean, it's, 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 it's your decision and your house. <laughs> I would totally be up for that. I'm just saying. <laughs> so cool. I don't know which of us looks better right now, Simon. Uh, you do, of course. <laughs> Uh, you've got a nice little sort of yeah, whiff at the back, which right. is good. This is, the only, this is only the second time I've been filmed having my hair cut. Well, me. anybody who ever saw our first episode, it was during lockdown in pandemic. Simon was trying to cut his own hair, and that's actually when I started filming. I was like, no, no, I've got to capture this moment for our family and friends. And that started the whole Chateau trying, Love. It started Chateau Love, exactly. He tried to cut it, and then, and then I tried to cut it. And then it went from bad to worse. <laughs> It was an absolute disaster. So now we're so happy that Annalise is here. <laughs> yeah, oh, trust me. Passing and she's, you know, doing a great job. So. Yes. I feel the same way. Lockdown was not a good time for her. Yeah. You see how necessary you are in all of our lives, Annalise. Thank you. Absolutely. I feel really appreciated right now. I Very loved. loved. Essential <laughs> worker. We really felt like hairdressing was essential work. I feel fabulous, Annalise. I love it. I mean, you'd put me out of a job if you were to look like that every single morning. Yeah. And it would be less fun as well. It's nice to see, like, when you can come in here and, like, look at it and, like, the different lights that you've got. Even I'm still, like... Oh, yeah, yeah. You're yeah, checking out all the different colours. <laughs> and Liz puts lots and lots of different colours through it. It's really pretty. Now, look at that hairstyle, Michael. Oh, no, you can only dream of that hairstyle. I, I, if I don't even know, you know I, would have, I would have put myself under the knife. Because it's... <laughs> <laughs> Liz, just gorgeous. Yeah, you know it as well, don't you? Yeah, it's super. I know the seal of approval is from Vivian. When the wife yes. goes, oh yeah, brilliant. big smile. I give a hundred and ten percent thumbs up. <laughs> yes, it's a lot better than when I did it. Yes. <laughs> Well, that's no compliment at all. That was a very low bar. <laughs> As it's Vivian and Simon's last day, we're going out in the car, but I can't find anyone. It's like herding cats. Nope. No one in the vegetable garden. We thought we'd lost Tonton Stephen, but there he is in his darling yellow trousers, getting in with Vivian and Simon. Hooray! <laughs> Oh, the 
this is the life, isn't it? Ooh. Okay, I'm going in for a bit of random puff pastry <laughs> because who doesn't want that to start <laughs> the day? <laughs> random. You managed to find the piece as well. It's a genius idea of yours to come here. I didn't know they had a terrace in summer. I've only been to their main restaurant. It's so pretty. It's so gorgeous. Cheers, Tom Thomas. Even you and I are very much going <laughs> yes. for the wine first. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers, all. Cheers. Oh, I have serrano ham and goat's cheese on an olive cake, I think. Oh, this is exciting. And you've gone for rabbit riette mm -hmm. with a, a swanky little quail's egg there, I see. Uh, oh, that's your favourite bit, the mm -hmm. onion confit. And Vivian. Oh, yes. I nearly went for that salmon tartare. It's, it's, I've had it before, actually. It's really good. <laughs> and Simon's, it's amazing. Yeah, just... This is, this is my... <laughs> Uh, Simon's depriving himself because he knows what he's about to get for his main course and it would feed the whole table. And also you're having dessert, aren't you? You're the only one who's ordered dessert. Ordered dessert, dessert. Ordered dessert and six beers. Yeah. There we are. <laughs> but Tatiana, I think yours might be the most spectacular gambas. And that beautiful. Beautiful. And it is delicious. I'm beginning to wonder if I should have followed your recommendation, Simon, because I know it said pork chop, but I wasn't expecting it to be literally falling apart like it that. It's gorgeous. It's like so good. I have gone for fish. I can't remember what fish it is. I mean, maybe someone can tell by looking at it, but it's a fillet of something. Is it Lyon? We think it's a fillet of Lyon Noir. Thank you very much. Someone was paying attention to my order. Oh, it's also written on the border. <laughs> Simon, you've gone above and beyond. I have. I'm just putting it back. I decon I deconstructed yeah, you regretted it. I'm it. reconstructing it. And it's got a ganache on the top. Only because of your generosity. I feel I have to try. Because yes. it'll be rude to say no at this of point. Course, of course. So I'm, I'm going to give it well, a that's shot. That's exactly what you should do. Oh, that's so good. Really good. Lovely. Are you ready for a birthday gift? I'm yeah. always ready for a birthday gift. I warn you, it's, it's, very, it's very small, it's little. But sometimes best things come in small packages. My aunt has told me this all of yes. my life. Your, your aunt, by the way, is absolutely my jewellery icon. Oh, yes. Nobody Everyone's jewellery icon. She does. You always say the best things come in small packages. Absolutely. The best things do come in small packages. Absolutely. Simon, <laughs> Simon helped me wrap this small package, believe it or not. It took two of us to wrap this I don't imagine him a gift wrapper. Mm. Well, you see, you just and Philip. And then walk in. Straight yeah. to You're not allowed to open your eyes. <laughs> okay, now you can open your eyes. <laughs> I don't see a package. You don't see a small package. I don't guess right. I feel like we should make you search for it. It's so small that you... Can we play hot and cold? <laughs> yes, you can. Yes, you can. We can play hot and cold. Okay. Hot and cold. Okay. Colder, colder, colder. Warmer, warmer, warmer. Colder, colder. Oh, sure. Warmer, warmer. Hot, 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 hot. Yeah, I should help with this. <laughs> Keep going. Keep going. No, you did not! <laughs> no way! No way! I cannot believe you got that! Yeah, so you liked it, and it didn't fit in your car. And it actually didn't fit, it, it didn't fit, it didn't fit in our car either, and so we strapped it to the roof. So showing up at Patron Day and trying to hide this from the roof for you was funny. Thank you. Oh my goodness, you should not have done that. Oh, oh no, it's our pleasure. Thank you so much, Sorry, I can't believe it. Has anyone actually seen what it is? I don't think so. No, yes. It's the bed that yeah. I saw in Lasha when we were okay. antique shopping together and I fell madly in love with it, but I was being really well behaved and I hurt. didn't get you it. Didn't get it. No. Oh, I love it so much. And I haven't even seen all of the side pieces. It's, it's in good condition. And this thing, this is what's so funny. I didn't realize it came with this big nice nice. And so um, so, so we went and I said, oh, don't worry, Simon, we'll go on the way to patron day, so we'll just put it in the back of the car. <laughs> and then we show up, there's this thing, and <laughs> he had to go home and get the roof rack. Oh, <laughs> so we showed up, I'm we so showed sorry, up here sorry, looking, sorry. looking like the Beverly Hillbillies with this <laughs> little on top of our car. <laughs> but this has been really good in keeping the peacocks off the roof. So that was, <laughs> so that was nice just over the last three days. The so there we go, now antique bed pieces <laughs> for all of the cars at Lanarm. Yeah. Oh, I cannot well, believe you did happy that. Happy birthday. Of course, happy birthday. Best birthday present. Yeah. Not to work out where to put it.
Isn't it just That's beautiful? That's the fun. Yeah. Don't you find it stunning? It, it's it's so much prettier, and you know when we finally were able to have a look at it, it's it's actually really lovely. It's in perfect condition, and it's really old. The fabric is perfect. I don't know if you can tell, but it's all metal. So it's like the old campaign furniture, isn't yeah. it? But you can yeah. sort of move apart and travel around with it. These have a really like cool wood. kind of like yeah. patina. It is. The... It's painted to look like wood, but I like it just mm -hmm. like this. Absolutely. I love it so much. This fabric is to die for. I, I still can't believe you did that. Well, we went back and it was still there. Then, so we thought it's meant to be. <gasps> oh, it's so beautiful, isn't it? Oh, this is lovely. Oh, what a beautiful... I fell in love with it, but then I was sensible and I didn't buy it, and Vivian went back and bought it secretly for my birthday. It's a day bed. You can have it in the Quisera field. Well, it's actually a bed, but I don't see why not. Yes, we haven't worked out where we're putting it yet, but it's so beautiful. Oh, that is absolutely gorgeous. Uh, hang on. We've got something in common. We have. Yeah. Yeah. All, all the terrible things. Yeah. yeah. The all the secrets. I think you two need to be kept apart as much as possible, actually. There's too many secrets. <laughs> yeah. They're going to start sharing each other's clothes <laughs> soon, I know it. And brooches. I love these shorts. They might, they might go missing. <laughs> Thank you so Excellent. much. This is well, Thank you for hosting us. Right. Most incredible trip. See you really soon again. Yes. This is so great. You just keep accidentally meeting up. We have we have an accidentally happy occurrence coming up soon. Bye. 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 Thanks again. No, a bientôt. A bientôt. I've woken up on my birthday and I'm starting with the most important decision of the day. What birthday tea am I going to start with? I'd usually go for breakfast blend, but I think it might have to be royal blend for a mm. birthday. These biscuits too. Would you mind opening my present to you? That's this one, isn't it? Yes. So you might recognise the packaging. I know exactly where you got it from because it says Chateau Love on it. So it's from Vivian. So I bought it at Vivian's shop and... Maybe she sells a lot of jewellery. <laughs> it means a jewellery box. And I, I, I loved it. So I, um, it reminded me of you. Oh, there's a beautiful piece. I can't see what it is, but look how beautiful that is with the fleur de lis. And <gasps> Philip, I love it. Do you love it? But I saw it before. I saw it when I saw Vivian. Yes. She told me it was uh, going to be on her shop, so I kept an eye out. This is a Victorian uh, fob, isn't mm -hmm. it? It is exquisite. I also like the fact that, you know, the name of the store is Chateau Love. So I feel like, you know, we found love at the Chateau. <laughs> so it's fitting. I love it. It's beautiful, right? You know how much I love citrines. But now I've got a stress ball. It's a spinner fob. I know, this reminded me of you, so I really hope you like it. I love it. I Thanks. thank you so much, darling. It looks perfect, don't you? I would say you should stop spoiling me, but you really shouldn't stop spoiling <laughs> me. <laughs> I love you so much. Happy birthday. Thank you. Philip has styled it for uh, me. I've just shortened the thing slightly. Yeah, I like it. It's, it's very elegant. It looks beautiful. And I have to wear something that will go with it today. I'm going to plan everything around this. Are you? Did you do it? Did you do it? And you even did. I'm inspired. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to do the candles. Shrines on She's sparkly and has a flower crown. I should have known it was you because of the flower crown. It's all in the details. The again. <laughs> it looks beautiful and maria's just told me that it's lemon and lavender is it lavender from the garden yep. from the garden from the courtyard no i'll eat it with my fingers start 48 as i plan to go on <laughs> mm. this is from gerald i recognize the handwriting straight away i know this is something on your wish list 
learn to fly a real aircraft with this fantastic <laughs> flying lesson experience. Wow. <laughs> this is something I have been wanting to do for so long. You're going to come with me? Absolutely. Really? You trust me? <laughs> well, <laughs> we'll see. I think that's going to start a bug. I think once is I've had one lesson. Is this the first time Land Airways? Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it here first. <laughs> Gerald, if you're watching, you that is amazing. <laughs> 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 This is excellent. It's us in Vienna. <laughs> <laughs> I just opened this beautiful tin. And what do I find? The most beautiful palmiers that have ever been made in the history of biscuits. Wow. You made them. Well, I don't know about that. No, they are. They, they are. So what are they? And I'm looking at them next to the most delicious Fortnum & Mason's biscuits. And look, they hold their own, don't they? They hold their own. <laughs> Rustic, but made with... Love and servitude. All right, I'm going in. <laughs> what? <laughs> Had a delayed response on that one. Okay, I've grabbed one, adding it to my little pile. Pass them around. I'm just having a very modest start to the day. There'll be at least four more biscuits there as well. The others have gone, and now we get down to the real importance of the day, putting together the Playmobil carriage. There is a look of rapt concentration <laughs> on Philip's face. I love Playmobil. I, ha I have so much in my parents' house still. And we are following the instructions very carefully. Always. So I was in charge of the horses. Mm, you can tell you're allergic, Angel. Are they supposed to be walking backwards? Well, I don't think anyone could have got that right. That was very confusing. Is it? Yes. <laughs> this is why we don't have any horses. The horses have decided that they're going to play nicely and they're going the right way around now. And they've got a little picnic basket with fruit and champagne. And it's a beautiful day for my birthday. I can't believe it. I've been so, so lucky with the patron days and with my birthday. Is there a knock? Oh, yeah. Hello. Oh, what a beautiful sight. Who wouldn't want to see that on their birthday? Come in, come in. <laughs> Thank you so much. How are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing? Yeah, she is really beautiful. I love your dress, by the way. No. I thought I really liked it on the hanger, and I got it home and I tried it on, and I was like, oh, I'm not sure, but no, I think you look really pretty. I like the colour a lot. Great choice of card. Thank you. I think they might want cake. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, wait, yes, let me get a plate. Oh my god, wow. It's a Barbie cake. That, uh, t -t -t that is gorgeous. Annalise surprised me by saying that she would do another blow dry for my hair so I'd have curls for tonight. It's massive. You said the bigger the better. And I meant every word. <laughs> You've made me yellow roses. My favourite roses. Yeah, they're currently in like a bouquet. I will uh, <laughs> add some foliage later. I love the way you've disguised the courgettes. It's beautiful. Well, we've got to use the produce. Well, yeah, but also, we haven't food. had a glut. I don't know, courgettes, it's just been no, delicious. It's just it hasn't been, been a problem. Yeah, it's that is cool. the most beautiful serving of courgettes that I have ever, ever seen. See, Mar Marie gave you real flowers and I'm making edible, edible, edible ones. Edible. Well, you know, there's a lot to be said for that. Yeah. Oh, they're pretty yeah. in the yellow. <laughs> Before I run upstairs to get dressed, I want to show you all once again this absolutely stunning painting that Bas Koenigs is auctioning on behalf of the restoration of the chapel at Lalande. It was by his beloved partner, Anke Brockstra, now sadly departed. And it's just one of the paintings in an online auction of many of her beautiful works of art. And he's very much hoping that they will go to homes where they will be loved and appreciated. The auction is on Katawiki. I will put a link to it now and in the description box. And it ends on Saturday, the 26th of August. Everyone started arriving for tonight's party and I can't wait to show you the table. I've just seen it myself for the first time. Isn't that just gorgeous? Philip knows that I love being on this side. I like having an evening with the fountain in the background. Even the sky is beautiful tonight. But you are even prettier than the table and you're also holding something that looks extremely delicious. Uh, not Philip friendly, <laughs> uh, have you? <laughs> <laughs> Philip, I love it. And with the yellow dahlias in the background as well, it's like it's part of it. Well, I love Marie's flowers and my mother helped and I think yeah, a lot of people helped getting everything ready because 33 people is a lot of people and I am not dressed. I'm going to run up and change. All right, see you. I love the peacocks and the bees and all the little blobs of yellow going all the way down. Not too much? Never. Not too much. <laughs>
never too much. It's very beautiful. And the tablecloth, the Tilda fabrics, it is stunning. Is it that the trousers are too long or the shoes are too short? Um, yeah, the it's a bit of both. It's only because I've been um, singing in concerts and this is the only smart thing I had. Hey! Pavlina, you look spectacular. Oh, thank you. And you look so beautiful. Natty's in yellow as well. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> God, the memo. <laughs> uh, these two are quite literally wearing exactly the same the shirt same from way. the yeah. same shop. Yes, yes. But you've it's styled it differently. I've styled it with creases. Yeah. Um, and the slimmer body. Night it. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, I've styled this by ironing it in a more <laughs> henched body. <laughs> All right, so it's muscles and an iron. Oh, I love or... the tan lines, by the way. No, it's in there. They're the only ones I got. Well, the rest of the the shorts are down and oh. the ounces out. Okay, well, that'll be later but... this evening. But <laughs> you two are a vision in yellow. Look what I prepare all day long. <laughs> yeah. Oh, all of us, all of us. Yeah, you two. The team. Yeah. As always, <laughs> you have completely outdone yourself. And oh well, my I mean, goodness, was... is this pork? Yeah, it's the pork like I did for the barbie mm. meal. It's I mean, my I favorite. Sauce from oh. the barbie meal. Uh, so, because I had the peaches last time, I've done the peach, yeah. nectarine, and tomato salad. But honestly, I couldn't have done this without Chantal and Steve. No, I saw they were with you all team. day in the kitchen, yeah. the three oh of God. you. We had loads of fun, it wasn't stressful. It it's is the, the dream nice. team. It's really much the dream team. Yeah, I think Christmas is also going to be Ooh. team. Uh, yeah. You heard it here first? Yeah, I know. <laughs> We've got couscous with the roasted aubergines and then uh, uh, raisins and dried Ooh. apricots. We've got a bruschetta with That's I'm so excited about that. We've got tomato nectarine salad, pork with confit shallots. Mm. Uh, Pavlina brought us two trays full of tiny, minuscule nano shallots and poor Chantal was peeling them forever. But that's uh, from the garden. garden. Yeah. And then we've got a roasted um, yellow pepper and uh, green bean salad with a goat's cheese carrot on. I do like the amount of yellow on this table. I think so, yeah. And then this is my uh, uh, endive salad with the yellow zucchini and grapefruit. And we've got avocado here. Not ricotta, oh. avocado for everyone. And then uh, Stephen's potatoes. With oh, bread. yes. And the uh, chamoy sauce. Thank you. Well, shall we eat? Because yeah. Yes, I'll call everyone in. Thank you. And the flowers as well. I think I oh should pause God. for a Marie, moment to look at the Marie, flowers. Marie told us it would be uh, spectacular, and I think definitely she, she was right. It is spectacular. Perfection. So everyone's got a lovely buffet uh, dinner that yes. Chantal, Steve and I have created. But you have a special starter. You are allowed to eat other things. But this is the worst thing I've ever created. <laughs> and I think you're the only person who would actually get excited about eating it. Okay, this I'm already are excited. You ready? The worst thing the, uh, Maria has the, uh, ever created. Yeah. Oh. Oh yes, you angel! You are an angel. I love you. Like a bird's eye view of your crabstick lobster. That I love you <laughs> so much. So with some bananas. No. I did. I did a dance style lemon twist. No. <laughs> so take inspiration from all the uh, My only problem is that I'm sitting next to Nick, and he is going to steal every bit of this off my plate. Excellent, because I can't believe I had to do that thank and you. smell that. Thank you. Thank and you. Touch that. Thank frankly. you. Thank you. Never again. Happy birthday. Maria doesn't approve of crab sticks <laughs> she morally disapproves of the whole concept of a crab stick she started it's fantastic <laughs> is it the food that's the nicest thing or is it the lovely people really hard to tell people it's the food no it's my uncle's aioli my uncle makes the best garlic mayonnaise in the world is it this one yes i didn't properly film your outfit earlier Dana, you look superb. Thank you. Did my yellow part? Yes. Is okay. It's warmed my heart. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Don't you dare! Yeah. Did you do it again, Dan? Yeah. Did you see it? Of I haven't it. seen it. No, did you Dan? do it real this year? He did it for Dan and Dana. You are in disgrace. The peacocks have decided to be especially picturesque this evening. I think they want to join in. But they're keeping a good eye on the proceedings from the rooftop. Every time I walked into the kitchen, you looked very elegant in an apron and quite flustered. Flustered? Yeah. Yeah, that's me. It's been that Two day. Two women in charge. Oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, for you, it's worth it. On your I really you. am. Yeah, on your Don't you dare. You've been sitting here down, have you? Don't you dare. The mind We're just mind. waiting for dessert, and I'm admiring the pink halo that everyone on this side of the table has. And they're having fun with their shadows in the chateau. <laughs> And now we can have a full puppet show. Oh, wow. All of that for me. Happy birthday to you. It's, a, it's the best day of the year. <laughs> One, two, three. You're looking so beautiful in the courtyard. Look at, oh, I know, oh, Mrs. Chic, and it's so long with the uh, assorted footwear. <laughs> Best thing on these gravel. <laughs> it's good to see you. Happy birthday, Steph. This is lovely to be with you on the day. Exactly. Thank you. We Bruce. haven't been there no, I know. Year either, so that's great. We could do that with you. But my long-term plan is we have to get a swimming pool because then I think we'll yep. have Antoine as a captive Absolutely. audience. Absolutely. Yeah, okay. Absolutely. That's what we need <laughs> to lure you here all summer. We're trying the Fontaine option, but it's not quite yeah, the same. Not, no, not no, quite. No. Not even with the inflatable people. No, 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 no. <laughs> Thank you all for joining me on my birthday. And to everyone watching, if you fancy a little bit more excitement this evening, you could join Ollie and I on our adventures in Istanbul, where we escape from a cold, snowy day to discover the secrets of the Spice Bazaar. That's out now on our channel, Travels With My Friend. I would like to say a huge thank you to the patrons of the Chateau Diaries and let you know that this week's patron video is Philip's full tour on the patron days itself of the Chateau de la Lande with lots of little architectural secrets that he's found. Today I'd like to say a special thank you to the Dauphins and Dauphines of la Lande, Sultana Al Faisal, Stephen Arnold, Joe Avon, Bill Ballard and Karen Baylett. Thank you so much for supporting the Chateau Diaries. Goodbye everyone and I look forward to seeing you all again on Thursday.